Hey guys and welcome to Star Wars The Old Republic Part 6 I said wrong in the last one, I said 4 instead of um, What was it again? 4 instead of 5 Sorry about that I'm Bathos and here we go And Salactory, still a This is the office of Admiral Fraval um, of the Imperial okay. Navy Do you have business here? Um, that's right I'm here to see the Admiral, let me in I don't think so I doubt the Admiral would have anything to do with your kind. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm very busy. Mashiska, damn it, you're supposed to accept me. If you'll excuse me, I'm gonna shoot you in the head. What? Whoops. You wouldn't dare. What's all that racket out there, soldier? There's a quarrelsome alien here, Admiral. It refuses to leave. I'm a Mashiska, awesome. damn it. You're as weak as you are, stupid. I requested a mercenary from the Mandalorians. Send that person in immediately. Yes, sir. You may go in now. Never stand in my way again. Not what I wanted the to answer, but okay. Waiting. Frabald. Freyball. Come in, mercenary. I apologize if my secretary caused you grief. He is of low birth and his intelligence reflects it. <laughs> I'm afraid many of our Imperial soldiers are hopeless with delicate tasks. This is, of course, why I asked for a professional. Smart move. That was good thinking. Ah, yes, just so. I have every faith in the Mandalorian Enclave's ability to get things done discreetly. My daughter has become something of a liability to me. I want you to kill her. That's something you don't hear every day. Then I'll assume you're newly arrived to Droman Cass. Things work a bit differently here. My daughter was born Force-sensitive and trained to be Sith. A great honor for our family. Unfortunately, my daughter's master is one Lord Grather. A man who oh. is now disgraced in the eyes of the Dark Council. Why not just get her a new master? It's outside of my control. The Sith manage their oh, own affairs, okay, the rest okay. of us merely suffer the consequences. If Lord Grathen's compound is raided and my daughter captured or killed, every member of her family will suffer. This is Sith politics. In the best case scenario, I lose my rank and position. In the worst... Um... You'd get squashed like a bug? An inelegant way to phrase it, but yes. Okay. Lord Grathen is a paranoid madman. His compound is built to withstand a siege, but a lone infiltrator will take them by surprise. My daughter is somewhere inside Lord Grathen's compound. Her name is Veretta. You will know her as she resembles me closely. Okay. Is there going to be fallout for taking down a Sith? Not oh. as long as nobody knows what happened. Okay, I'm guessing they will. Hang on, I've been running some data. Turns out renegade Sith Lord followers rack up death marks like crazy. Lord Grathen's top people all have prices on their heads. Oh. It'd be a shame to let those bounties go to waste. And we might need those extra credits to gear you up for the big melee. Oh, yeah. Remember, discretion is essential. Do Seems not let yourself awesome. be captured. Good luck. Thank you. Wow. Oh. Okay. Seems defeat as Gretham Estate Overlords down there. Well, I'll see you right there. Here we are, bunt out of face. So we're uh, okay, one overlord. Almost done. Two more to go. One left. Level 16! Sweet. I didn't go with healing, but still I'm getting a lot of healing abilities. Oh, what have we here? You're not even a Mandalorian, are you? Frabble. When Lord Grath and Spy said my father contacted the Mandalorian Enclave, I expected they'd at least send me a real live Mandalorian. I'm afraid I'm a tad disappointed. What does it matter who kills you? A woman has to have standards. Wait, you don't seriously think you can kill me? I mean, I'm a Sith and you're just... <laughs> whatever you are. Oh, we've got a true believer. Then again, yeah. it makes sense. 
Why would you come here if you thought you'd die? Apparently my father isn't the only one living in a dream world. You can't kill a Sith, you silly. You believe you're Sorry? invincible, little girl? No, of course not. A more powerful Sith could kill me. Or a really lucky Jedi, I suppose. <laughs> Perhaps a bomb, but not some random <laughs> bounty hunter. You must be so crushed. Live and learn, I guess. Except, not in your case. Sorry. I should have thought twice about you about your decision here, lady. Let's use the proton photon torpedo. Boom. Woo! Awesome. Would you please mind to heal? To find out who's standing between us and a week on the beach. Oh, a week on the beach. I'd love to do that. Especially with you. What? I, I lost? Yep. I can't lose. I'm Sith. You were Sith. Now you're just done. Can't die like yep. this. Falling to some common bounty hunter. Everything Lord Grothen told me was a lie. I've been living in a dream world. It can't end like this. It can't. Yes, it can. Oh, yeah. It's time you and your father had a chat. No, that's worse. <laughs> worse than dying. Okay, if you say so. Return to Admiral Fraburn. Well, see you there. Here we are. And I just saw a level 50 Sith Juggernaut with 7,500 HP. I mean, that's what you should have on like level 30. Or oh, yeah, 30, 40, something over there. And they're talking now, oh, they have 30,000 HP, and that's because the GSI station you will see on Makib. If you press them, you can get your bo gear bolstered. That's a new thing as well. Reports of the raid on Lord Grathen's estate are pouring in. I trust you were successful in your endeavor. My daughter Beretta is... Mm. Beretta's not dead. I brought her back to you. You... you froze her. Why? I was so specific in my directions. Why in the galaxy mm. would you do this? <laughs> Why would you refuse a specific order and not... Eliminate the target. I figured it was a family affair. Yeah. You're incredibly insightful for a bounty hunter. As soon as you left the premises, I realized my mistake. A mistake that would haunt me the rest of my days. Done me a great service, hey. Hunter. She's all I have of her mother. She leaves then? You're not gonna kill her? No, of course not. Contain her <laughs> until she can be made to see reason. Here is your writ and your fee. Now, please. I need some time with my... with my daughter. Yeah, of course. Do that. See you at Krista again. Small affection gift there yeah, again. Oh, you shouldn't have. Oh, I should. I did. <clears throat> Just because of you, Meku. Second bounty is done. Just one more and I'm in the melee. Right you are. And competition oh. is heating up. That little green girl, Iopian Rattle, finished all her bounties. Wow. Heard she poisoned an Imperial moth. Oh. Lucky we didn't get that one. Not sure how we'd work it out. Now, I ain't allowed details on whatever you were scrapping for Admiral Fabal. But I got a clearance note says it was duly scrapped. Nice payday, too. Hmm. Yeah. It was a squabble between the Admiral and his Sith daughter. Complicated. Sounds right tricky, but the less I know, the better. Here we go. Bounty three. I call it someone's got a serious hate for my hunter. Top secret, crazy, red flag covered. This one's for a Captain Metal in Imperial Intelligence. 
No other Ooh. information. Uh, looks like I'm working for spies this time. Better not want us to poison someone. <laughs> Stay careful. Get this one done and don't get yourself dead in the process. Awesome. Who told well basic holy hell? That's a lot. Almost level 17 as well. Talk to Captain. Okay. Oh. Okay, yeah, see you there. Here we are, let's go. What the Oh right. The bounty hunter. Glad you could make it. Feeling nervous, alien. Standing in the middle of Imperial Intelligence. I can say one word, or touch one button, and you disappear forever. Poof. Gone. Hmm. Just like that. No I'm one would even dare to ask what happened to you. supposed to accept me. God damn it, how many times do I have to say that? Go ahead. Say the word and see what happens. <laughs> Nicely done. I like you, Hunter. I really do. Thanks. I never signed up for this cloak and dagger stuff. I was a regular soldier. Hmm. And one day, I put together a covert operate that goes a little too well. And bam, I'm an Imperial Intelligence. <laughs> Look, what I'm saying is the stuff that goes on in these halls is insane. And all of it is crazy hush-hush. So what I'm going to tell you has to stay just between you and me. Got it? Yep. My price tag always includes the cost of discretion. Here's the deal. There's a huge ancient Sith temple on Drummond Cuss. Used to just sit there being scary. Now the place <laughs> is crawling with Sith sorcery. And it's been ordered a no-go zone for everyone. Naturally, we sent a team in. My commander led that team. Nobody came back. We can't report any of them dead without reporting the mission, which puts me in a bind. Hmm. Why do I get the feeling I'm going to the temple? <laughs> because you've got warrior instincts, like, like me. me. If I can't prove my commander's dead, I can't take over his spot, which means an ugly power vacuum. I'm oh. ordering you to enter that temple and find the team's ID cards, especially my commander's. I need those IDs to create more acceptable deaths for them. Whoa. It's a done deal. I tell you, I envy you getting to do the fun part. Make sure you find an Imperial <laughs> Commander named me. Gargan. Can't imagine there'll be more than one corpse in a temple wearing Commander stripes. Grab all the team's ID cards and double time it back here quietly. Got it. And that one is... Like the last one on this planet. So, I'm gonna end this one right here. Uh, I'm not sure how long these episodes are. I mean, they, they can be like 10 minutes, they can be 15, I have no idea. Anywho, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and may the force be with you.